now day two. Well, technically day one. Day zero was the flight. Today is day one, and that is now th this day of Nsika. My roommates, which you will meet very, very soon, a bunch of other potters you've probably heard of, have woken Lindsay and I up. Lindsay and I are rooming together. Don't worry, it's separate beds. That way the sanctity of marriage between me and you can stay can stay pretty good. And today is this piece here. This piece here, however, has already gotten traded off. To who? I forgot his name. He was a wonderful man. He was like, my teacher sucked, but you were there for me when my teacher was not there for me. And I was like, yep, that, sound, that sounds about right. We are now walking to the convention center. Uh, the group that I am with mostly, in the car with, that's driving me around, is Nico, over here. I'll put her socials down below. And over here is April. Woo! Right? I don't Talk do about this. how cold it is. It is cold. It's not that it's not cold. It's California cold. We can't say it's cold because everyone on Instagram was like, oh, you're about to experience a different kind of cold, boy. I'm from California. It's about okay. to be cold up in there. Probably. I'm wearing one layer of jacket, no gloves. It's like whenever you mention it's hot and there's always someone in Texas who's like, I was born in a kiln. We, we were born in kilns. We're from California. <laughs> This is Roberto. He poached me <laughs> at Ensika and he got the uh and everything. I didn't want to get on your bad side so early in the morning. Well no, it's uh, it's fine. Well it's cause like I'm slept and I'm fed, so I'm relatively friendly for the next five hours. This is the first person we met. So yeah, I'm like And we have Mako here. Hi, my name is Alex with Mako Colors. Yeah. Uh, today at Nsika, we are handing out free samples of the Nimbus Blaze Stonewall number 194. Yes. It looks great at Cone 6, and it also has a really surprising Cone 10 performance as well. So it works at Cone 6 and 10? Cone, all of our Stonewall Blazes look great at Cone 6, and you can take them to 10 as well. And this one's so, Nimbus? This is Nimbus. Oh. So Nimbus is one of our 12 new uh, Blazes in our newest Stoneware release. Fantastic. Fantastic. Thank you so much. Yeah, no problem. Not so something that I didn't get to experience last year is if you talk to the presenters, which I did not last year. I'm trying very hard to be extra social. I drank the extra coffee. Is they give you little samples like that Nimbus we just saw right there. So we're gonna be testing that on the channel. We found we found more people who like the channel. Hi, Sharon. Hello, Sharon. <laughs> She's freaking out right now. Yep. I'm trying to calm down. Don't freak oh, out. No. It's okay. It's, it's good. It's good. The first, I am the Dante. Hello. 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 I was telling my mom. I was like, are there, see? Are you also see people? A person. We yeah. have more so people. Hello. Down. It's nice yeah. to meet Hi. What's your name? I'm Thelma. Keep sharing. Okay. All right. Keep sharing. Thank you. Fantastic. I was it's like, good to meet you. Like, it's good to meet you. Yeah. Yeah. Don't fang too hard, but no, it's, yeah, it's just this is how it goes. Thank you. So are you guys Thank you. I try. I try to be fun and informative. I try. I was looking at the thing and I was like, your name is there, but there's no event and I don't know what to do. We'll, we'll be there. We'll, we have like a little Q&A thing too, so please, okay. please come. How many of them are, how many of them are you? How many are you out there? Two <laughs> Have you met Dante? I tried to I tried to get him. Dante. Hello. Him and Lindsay do the Potter's cast. Hello. Hi. We don't do the Potter's cast. Oh wait, 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 no, that, the, um, the mud peddlers. The mud peddlers. The mud peddlers. Are you it because I just blew that? No. It again? Um, no, it's okay. I'm actually, I'm in the house with Tim. We didn't meet everybody in the house, but Tim is one of them. I tried to get everybody in one place, but like we were all at the door by that time, so. 
So this over here is Clayscapes, and I think they're a little newer on the market, or I'm just not aware of them. But we are going to try and talk to them. Hey, how's it going? What's up? Good to see you. How are you? Good to see you too. I'm like a talking to people. Yeah. Talking to people? Sound glaze. Definitely. So this one here, this is the Starry Night. I'm not too versed on Clayscapes, can you tell me what you guys are about? Hey, so I'm Andrew, we're with Clayscapes Pottery here at Inseca. Um, we are a clay and tool manufacturer uh, supplier out of Syracuse, New York, and we're here displaying our Cone 6 glazes. We sell them dry for dipping and pouring, and they're all here. And so, yeah, we're just here to share the share the wealth, share the information. We might be testing some of these on the channel pretty soon. <laughs> wink, wink. Wink, wink, yeah, yeah. wink, wink. Laguna was doing a little bit of swag and he gave us this notebook right here and the pen with it. Oh, 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 oh. You are the CEO of Laguna Clay? I am. Let's let's hear what are you guys here about? What are you guys about? Well, we're here about promoting the arts. We love ceramics, we love clay. This show is particularly about glazes. Yes. So I think everybody knows Laguna Clay Company. So we're trying to shift that paradigm a little bit. Laguna Clay and Glaze. Laguna has a magnificent palette of glazes and they've just never promoted them. So we've decided this year is our first opportunity to really promote all the different temperatures, all the different styles of glazes that we have. They're really quite beautiful. we got a lot to see, so come down and visit us. And you guys are here all weekend? We're here all week. What's the new What's the new hot for you right now with the new glaze? Well, we have the new Rainforest glazes, which are really, really fun. Where are those? Those Rainforest glazes are scattered around more down here. So all those little vessels yeah. that are all the cups that have been made, those are all the new Rainforest glazes. Ah. Yeah. So we got those. We have all new glazed boards. So if you look at all these different boards, we've consolidated and put everything into the most popular glazes that Laguna makes and allowing everybody to make a choice a little bit easier, a little bit more accessible. All the other glazes are still available, but if you really want what's been the best sellers and most popular, we try to condense it all into five new boards so people can follow us a little bit with the glaze selection. And uh, you know, and our approach is always to reach out to the ceramic artists. It's just a phenomenal community. We love them and it's just great They're to be pretty a part good of people. They're, ma they're amazing people. Yeah, well, thank you. Thank you for your time. It was good to meet you. Nice to meet you. Too. Fantastic, fantastic. What's up, Dante? Hi, I just wanted to say hi to you. I order chemicals from you all the time. Thank you so much. Thank it's you so, so much. good to meet yeah, you. Thank you so much, Dante. Yeah, nice I love you. Yeah, yeah, you guys are awesome. Thank no, you so much. No problem. Yeah. Wow, you have yeah, yeah. so much stuff here. What are you presenting? Yeah, sure, sure. Uh, Lindsay and I have a podcast yeah. called Mud Peddlers. And so we're, we're doing that this year. We're on our panel. The clothes are so much more saturated than like regular Mason jeans. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I love them so much. I actually love U.S. pigments, like on God. Like I, I've essentially ordered all my minerals from them uh, and Imco. I stopped going anywhere else. Aardvark, hello. Hi. Nice to meet you. I did a review on your charcoal clay. I love it so much. Yes, we love that you loved it. Uh, we are a company, a family company that's been here since 1972. Uh, our newest product is that charcoal that you loved so much, and we're very proud of it. But we do everything from cone five, low fire, cone ten. We make our own glazes. Uh, we kind of do everything, and we carry the other brands as well. So fantastic. Oh, yeah. thank you so much. Can I take a look around? Absolutely. Thank you so much. Of course. I technically haven't eaten breakfast and neither has anybody else in my group. So we're gonna take a small break and we're gonna go to lunch. And uh, I don't know if you wanna see us eating, that'd be kinda awkward, but uh, put it in the comments below if you have some kind of eating kink. You know what, shame on you. Actually, I'm just gonna skip it.
Hi. How are you? It's nice to meet you. Nice I've meet spoken you. to you online. Yes. I see you have a booth here. We do have a booth here. We are debuting six new colors for our new light extension called Potter's Choice Flux. These glazes are designed after our Honey Flux glaze, the ever so popular, and they are designed for movement and flow. So right here you can see a couple of them layered with our Potter's Choice glazes. This one is the new PCF Honeydew over PC16 Purple Crystal Fire Decone 6. And then over here you can see PCF75 Moss Mist over C53 Weeping Plum. Fantastic. Oh, I remember Weeping Plum. Mm -hmm. So a lot of great color combinations. Again, designed for movement and flow. Thank you. Thank You're you so welcome. much. Thank you. It's good to meet you. You too. I just saw Amico Glaze's table and I got to see the person who like contracted me to do all the Amico Glaze videos that you guys like so much. And I got to meet the person who develops their glazes. His name's Corey. And I got to talk his ear off about glaze chemistry. I was so happy for those five minutes. They have a new glaze out called Amico Flux. I'm gonna try and get a couple of those on hand so that way we can test them for you. They seem to be over glazes, but you know, we're gonna do a little more. So right now, Tim C has a group of people going to this shot glass exchange at this place called Queen City Clay. We're gonna go in there, go to the back, and party with Tim and his people. This is great. Everything about this says exactly what I am and who I am as a person. It's my defining trait. It's beautiful. So the way that it works with the line that you just saw is everybody lines up, puts their piece inside of a paper bag. We don't look for a while. We finagle and schmoodle with some soda and some food. We come back after they've mixed the bags around a little bit and we pick one up. And this is how we do the exchange in a fair and equal way. No one knows what's in the bags once they mix them up, not even the people who mix them themselves. Lindsay and I just went upstairs to do a little bit of a podcast with one of the people who work at Queen City. But guess who I found when I came back downstairs for the Clay Buddies meetup? Ryan and Becca. I had I didn't think they would be here, but they're here. We're here. We got here nice and late. Did you guys put something in? Yeah, we got. I did not. It's all good. It's all good. The guy. I don't have room in my van. There was one guy who met me, and he's like, I've been watching your YouTube video for a long time. I just met him, and he's like, I got yours. I got, wild. I got Tim nice. C's last year. Did you? For like two years ago, yeah. So wild. Let's go. This place is truly amazing, Quinn City Clay, let me tell you. It almost makes me want to move to Ohio just to be part of this like weird pottery commune, but then I would have to live in Ohio, so. Okay, that was a lot for me socially. I think we're going back to the house now. Mm -hmm.